Lipids play many important roles when it comes to our food and within our bodily processes. This video will introduce the concept of what lipids are. Lipids are composed primarily of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. Some lipids also have other elements, such as phosphorus, as part of the molecule. As a brief example, phospholipids are found within cell membranes and are also very useful in foods as they can be used as an emulsifier. Lecithin is one. The reasoning behind why lipids are so energy dense comes from the fact that they contain a much larger number of carbon and hydrogen atoms as compared to proteins or carbohydrates. Lipids are typically soluble in organic, non-polar solvents such as alcohol and ether, but have very limited solubility in water. The predominant form of lipids found is in the form known as a triglyceride. Triglycerides are composed of a glycerol molecule and three fatty acid molecules. The glycerol backbone is composed of a simple three carbon chain with bonds to hydrogen and oxygen. It is considered an alcohol and is the only portion of the triglyceride that can be converted into glucose in the event that the body needs to manufacture it from fat stores. Since its size is quite small as compared to the rest of the molecule, triglycerides are considered a very poor source for gluconeogenesis. The fatty acid chains cannot be used in this process. They are converted into ketones. Fatty acids are rarely found free floating within the body or within our foods. They are typically connected to a glycerol molecule in some shape or fashion. But as an individual unit, a fatty acid can take on a few different forms. The foundation of a fatty acid is typically comprised of an even numbered hydrocarbon chain, usually 4 to 24 in length, which contains a methyl group on one end, that's the CH3, and a carboxyl group on the other, that's the COOH. How the carbons are bonded to one another will identify whether or not the fatty acid is considered a saturated or unsaturated fatty acid. Saturated fatty acids containing 16 or 18 carbons are the most common form of the saturated fatty acids.